In the Arizona desert, some migrants are spontaneously presenting themselves to the U.S. Border Patrol. Our next report has all the details. Take a look. These are the sand dunes from the desert of Yuma. Yuma is a city in southwest Arizona. It's in the news because of distress calls of migrants. Migrants from Colombia, migrants from Peru, migrants from Mexico, migrants who are risking their lives in an attempt to escape the violence with the hope to get political asylum. We arrived by plane in Mexico and from there to here by bus. And what are you asking for? Asylum? Yes, to ask for political asylum. Why? Because of the violence in Colombia, all the displaced people. These migrants are presenting themselves to the U.S. Border Patrol. Stationed near an opening in the wall raised at the Yuma border under the then U.S. President Donald Trump because of frozen Title 42 health policy, a policy meant to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Officials believe that their numbers are going to increase with time. This week we started seeing that decline. We're seeing right now about 150, 120 people. Um, that includes children, um, babies, um, right for this week. So it really decrease for us. Uh, but the expectation is that they we're going to go back to potentially the same number of people, maybe 400 a day or so. The plight of these migrants is unbearable as they travel miles in dangerous conditions. What was it like to come? Dangerous, dangerous. We were risking our lives. How did you come? Over there, the water came up to me over here. Yes, it was dangerous and we cut ourselves. Unfortunately, even if this means that they have to enter illegally, these migrants do so only to be able to enhance their quality of life by getting a chance to stay in the USA. Bureau Report, We On, World Is One.